Hey, did you know that every person is unique, like a fingerprint or a butthole print? Yet, some species think that they need to be the most unique out of everyone. I think we all have heard this phrase, I am not like other girls. Or you might also know them as a pygmy girl. And today I want to find out how to identify the true pygmy girl. Why being not like others will never work and basically I just want to have fun. And because I want to have fun and I can be funny, I'm already started to get related to the NLTOG club. Oh, sorry, not pink. Because for some reason, having a nice sense of humor is being different. First thing that every member should despise is of course romantic films. Other girls. Me. I'm so sorry for Stone Age memes. If someone kisses in the movie, stop it immediately. Even if you're in the cinema, you gotta get out. And of course, the main villain in this universe is a Barbie film. If vampires are weak on the light and cats are scared of cucumbers, then NLTOG members are scared of Barbie movie. POV, you're the only girl who DGAF about the Barbie movie. Actually, I'm pretty sure that my grandma doesn't even know about the existence of this film. So the point goes to her. Another very important aspect is the public opinion, which in their language means never talk to a girl. Or we can call them one of the guys. Their distinguishing features are that they like to have fun, eat pizza and play games. Never had a desire to do such things, these ladies should be wild. Look, she will never try to curl her hair on a finger near the boys. Instead, she will put a pizza in her mouth and run away. I wish I could be so different. Please support me with a like and subscribe so I can do this. And what's really funny, they really think eating junk food and having a friendship with a guy makes you so special that they created a whole new club named one of the guys. Because obviously only boys eat pizza. Always preferred hanging in the garage with the guys trying to fix the four-wheelers we broke instead of the exciting dinner and movies the girls did. Always prefers having a child for a million dollars over nothing. Exciting dinners. Manual labor. In this similar video, we can see an explanation of what really happens in the video. Now I get it, she tries to get attention of a guy by bringing her food everywhere around. And looking exactly the same as usual with makeup, better say with TikTok filters, but with messed up hair. I think this makes all the difference. This might work. And now please, can I have your attention? Here we have the list of rules for the real NLTOG. Do not wear tons of makeup. Maybe I don't get something, but it doesn't seem as if this not like the other girl's girl has little makeup. Or we have a red in our club. I don't spend hours getting ready. I do play games. So do I. We're so unique. I love memes. I don't like TikTok. Okay, so girls that we've seen one minute ago, either not real NLTOG or they film their TikToks because they're obligated to do that. And I am not afraid of cockroaches. I am afraid of cockroaches, so I have to pass. But who doesn't? If bed bugs live in a bed, then where do cockroaches live? Being around the man doesn't mean that you can be romantic with them. Well, I didn't mean that particularly. I have so many questions and I prefer to stay with no answer. I hope it's something about hobby horsing. Some of them blame others for being a pick me girl. But in real life it looks something like this. She is such a pick me girl. I'm better pick me. If this girl got confused by those tournaments, then the next one even tries to avoid being a human to become more different. But do you think she is not like others because she can have fun or because she is a cookie? But for some reason it's misspelled. But being a cookie is kind of unique, so okay, she passed this test. Just hope she's not a chocolate one. I hate them. Some of the NLTOG club's members even try to avoid looking like others, but instead of tattooing a tiger on their face, which would definitely make them not like others, they start to hate on doing your makeup, nails or hair, and of course pink. Because no one has a right to think that they can do something like someone else. Do you think they wipe? Everyone wearing makeup to college. Me with bare face. Contouring. Normal girls. Me. 
This could be a good meme if you erase a word contouring. Gents, don't hit anyone no matter what. Rather do this instead. I'm so glad that I'm the type of girl to hate makeup. Now he'll rather get a therapy. At least one good thing. And of course, never forget to tell how much you hate these girly aspects at every opportunity. Normal girls have the stress about what color to have their nails. My stress is what football shirt to wear tomorrow. You can dislike girly stuff partially if that suits you. Like doing your makeup and hair but troll people with manicure. But remember the main rule, never be fully girly. Even better, be boily. So I never tried the chicken sandwich at Poppy's, I never saw the Barbie movie. And I didn't go to the Beyonce concert. And I won't eat a cookie from here. Why am I like this? <laughs> I can't understand why they don't want to watch... Polska. I can't understand why they don't want to watch a Barbie movie or go to the Beyonce concert. But what did the chicken sandwich do to you? Now I am very interested what they eat except pizza. The problem with our first world society is that most would get grossed out at me rubbing mud from my back hair on my face and hair, all while raving about the newest $50 mad mask from their favorite makeup brand. But seriously, I do think that when you have a face mask with some snail stuff, that means that you can take some random snail and put it on your face and have the same effect. At least I can relate to it. I made a dirt cakes when I was in a kindergarten. Cause we didn't have a sandbox. But the main difference is that I didn't eat them. Because it's still a usual dirt. Now that we understand food preferences better, I suggest you to learn more about club's uniform. When I purposely put on tighter and smaller clothes when my boyfriend comes over. I just be wearing a hoodie and sweats with no makeup and my hair in a messy bun. Okay, I would wear a ladybug costume, but unfortunately I don't have one. I thought we were sharing our ideas now. No? Okay, the next one. Other girls, fake tan, like spin, is on Instagram all the time, has expensive jewelry, wears makeup, is popular, goes out to party. Me, is always inside, likes black, is on TikTok, wears baggy clothes, doesn't get sleep, in a nerd, stays inside, likes rock music. I like rock's music too. It's about drive, it's about... I thought that being a depressed teenager is quite common stage. No, we need to show how much we're not a pink, happy person with a normal social life. And now we know that TikTok is the right way to become unique. As other 1.677 billion TikTok users. Actually, what does it mean in a nerd? Like inside of them or something? This girl will never understand how great it can be drawing a barcode on your forehead or on the back of your head. When was your last time walking in a room full of clones? I like to do this on Fridays. The most important thing about how to define a different girl is of course her character and interests. And how they hate every other girl. <laughs> I'm not like a regular girl, I'm a weird girl. Keep your coffee, concerts, designer purses. Give me hot chocolate, museums, dining experiences. What can make you more extraordinary than liking a hot chocolate? I believe that she has a big sign on her doors. Coffee, concerts and designer purses are restricted. Leave your regular boring stuff out of my house, please. I'm not like other girls. I'm worse. Here we have some sort of paradox. Saying that you're worse than someone else usually makes people sad, but not a picnic girl. This phrase makes them feel better and powerful more than anyone else. But only if they say it, not the other way. What would you call a girl that into books, gym, arts, D&D, video games? There's genders for all, but what if I'm all. I hope my words will not traumatize you, but you're a normal person with hobbies? Please don't do anything to me, it's just a joke. The scariest thing can happen when one of the boys meets a boy from one of the girls club. Like 90% of my friends are guys, I don't know how romance is. XD. Mao, I only have a few guy friends, most are chicks. Opposite for me. And then I play video games with guys online mostly, so... Now they are stuck in an endless loop trying to convince each other how much they hate their gender. And it starts to become into a torture where they can't be different. So they continue texting each other non-stop, hoping that one of them will lose. It's like ants running in circles following their trails. Anyway, I hope they dealt with it. For some reason, many people think that you are very unique if you don't act like an ass. I am not like most girls. I am gonna support you and your goals. I am not gonna control you. I am gonna defend you anytime. Oh yeah, and I don't want your money. I make my own. 
I'm here to build you, not to break. The funny thing is staying the completely opposite of this will make you truly different. I'm like most girls. I'm not gonna support you and your goals. I'm gonna control you. I'm not gonna defend you anytime. Oh yeah, and I want your money. I don't make my own. I'm here to break you, not to build. Art, popo, yo. So much meaning that I can't get it. Waiting for hockey players to notice me and think, wow, she's not like the other girls. I had a classmate who didn't pay attention to a hockey game. And the hockey puck went right into his teeth. And I ain't joking, it happened during my high school years. This is the right way to get spotted in my opinion. The main problem is that these girls feel like everyone around is judging them. But they judge everyone even more. I really hope they can stop comparing themselves with someone else. And be free of these classifications and be unique and the same at the same time as every person in the world. Thank you for watching, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. I am a small creator and it is really important for me. Bye!